People ask us all the time, which wood should I choose for my kitchen utensils? I've got them laid out below me here and I'll give you some information about them and help you with that. Uh, right now, these are laid out from our hardest wood to our softest wood. Uh, this is our Mexican ebony, bloodwood, jatoba, and hard maple. Um, a lot of people will hear that and say, oh, I want this one because it's the hardest. But don't forget that this is hard maple. Uh, people make gym floors and bowling alleys out of hard maple. Uh, most kitchen utensils you'll find uh, available are made out of beech or fir, uh, which are both significantly softer than hard maple. So you're going in, even if you get the hard maple, you're getting a wood that's substantially better than most kitchen utensils you'll find out there. So, in the end, my advice to you is pick the one you like the color of most, uh, the one that's going to match your kitchen, match your decor, uh, and go with that. Because really, if you're looking for strength and toughness and hardness and things, you can't go wrong with any of these woods.